Have you ever wondered if the supplements you're taking are actually doing anything? Many people are left confused and frustrated when it comes to boosting nitric oxide levels, and L-citrulline is no exception. With so many conflicting opinions and studies, it's hard to know what to believe. L-citrulline has been touted as a miracle worker for athletes and fitness enthusiasts, promising to increase blood flow, reduce fatigue, and even enhance muscle growth. But what really caught our attention was its supposed ability to boost nitric oxide levels naturally. If you're like us, you've probably tried a handful of supplements claiming to do the same thing, only to be left feeling underwhelmed. This raises the question, is L-citrulline truly effective or is it just another overhyped supplement? But before we dive into the science, it's essential to understand why L-citrulline has gained so much popularity. It sounds too good to be true, right? So what's the real deal behind L-citrulline? To find out, we need to look at the evidence and separate fact from fiction. With so many supplement companies jumping on the L-citrulline bandwagon, it's easy to get caught up in the hype. But as a team committed to separating fact from fiction, we want to give you the lowdown on what the science really says. After all, not all supplements live up to their promises, and it's important to know what you're putting into your body. Nitric oxide is a molecule produced by our bodies that plays a crucial role in vasodilation, meaning it helps our blood vessels relax and expand. This can lead to increased oxygen delivery to our muscles, improved exercise performance, and even better overall health. So it's no wonder that supplements like L-citrulline have become so popular. But does L-citrulline actually deliver on its promises? But how does L-citrulline actually influence nitric oxide production? The theory is that L-citrulline is converted into L-arginine in the kidneys, which is then used to produce nitric oxide in the body. Sounds simple enough, right? But as we'll explore later, the science isn't quite that clear-cut. There are many factors that can influence how effective L-citrulline really is. The relationship between L-citrulline and nitric oxide levels is still a topic of ongoing research, but let's dive into what some of the studies have found. A 2010 study published in the Journal of the International Society of Sports Nutrition found that L-citrulline supplementation increased nitric oxide production and improved exercise performance in healthy adults. This suggests that there may be some truth to the claims, but it's important to look at the bigger picture. Another study published in 2015 in the Journal of Strength and Conditioning Research found that L-citrulline supplementation increased muscle protein synthesis and reduced muscle soreness after exercise. While these findings are promising, it's essential to note that the results weren't exactly consistent across all studies. This inconsistency raises questions about the reliability of L-citrulline's benefits. Some studies have found that L-citrulline had no significant effect on nitric oxide levels or exercise performance. For example, a 2016 study published in the Journal of the American Medical Association found that L-citrulline supplementation had no effect on blood flow or oxygen delivery in patients with heart failure. This highlights the complexity of the issue and the need for more research. More recently, a 2020 review published in the Journal of Sports Science and Medicine found that while L-citrulline may have some benefits for exercise performance, the evidence was inconsistent and more research was needed. So, what's going on here? Why are the results so mixed? The answer may lie in the design and execution of these studies. One possible explanation is the varying dosages and durations of L-citrulline supplementation used in these studies. Some studies used high doses of up to 20 grams per day, while others used much lower doses. Similarly, some studies lasted for weeks, while others only lasted for days. This variability makes it difficult to draw definitive conclusions. Another issue is the quality of the supplements used in these studies. Let's face it, not all supplements are created equal, and the quality can vary greatly depending on the manufacturer. So, it's possible that some studies may have used low-quality supplements that didn't contain enough L-citrulline to elicit any significant effects. This could explain why some studies show benefits while others do not. So, what's the current consensus in the scientific community? While there's some evidence to suggest that L-citrulline may have benefits for exercise performance and nitric oxide production, the evidence is far from conclusive. 
More research is needed to fully understand its effects and to determine the optimal dosage and duration of supplementation. Until then, it's best to approach L-citrulline with caution. The takeaway here is that L-citrulline is not a magic bullet for boosting nitric oxide levels. While it may have some benefits, it's essential to approach these supplements with a critical eye and to consult with a healthcare professional before adding them to your regimen. Your health is too important to leave to chance. In conclusion, L-citrulline is not the simple solution that many supplement companies would have you believe. While it may have some benefits, the science is complex and more research is needed to fully understand its effects. It's important to stay informed and make decisions based on evidence rather than marketing claims. If you're interested in learning more about L-citrulline and its potential benefits, we encourage you to do your own research and consult with a healthcare professional. And if you want to dive deeper into the world of supplements and nitric oxide, be sure to check out some of our other resources on the topic. Knowledge is power, and the more you know, the better decisions you can make. Thanks for joining us, and we'll catch you next time. Remember, your health is your greatest asset, so take the time to make informed choices.